This is gonna wee right over where Ace wee. <laughs> <laughs> so whose body language now we've hit her is completely It's a bit bemused to be fair. <laughs> it's it's all friendly, yeah? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. <laughs> but it is a little bit bemused because obviously Dogs don't expect Roxy to be so yeah. smash mouth. Like <laughs> she's a little dog, everyone expects a little dog to be yappy <laughs> or snappy. <laughs> a sucker for a rock rider with testicles. Oh, Careful, mate. Right. But see how he's starting to mirror her play, so he's starting to do the little bouncy bit. Yeah. He has got a lot better since we last put him around the dog, though. He d he's not so much full on, jump straight on no. the dog. He's a lot more... He's a lot less pouring. And... Yeah, and like I said, there's the beauty of the pack hawks in the class. He's teaching him that there's another way of socialising with dogs, not just mm. playing and roughhousing. Most, like I said, most people with assertive breeds like Rottweilers, like German Shepherds, like Dobermans, the mistake they make is when they're a puppy, they think they need to socialise them with absolutely every dog they see. But what they're actually doing is over-socialising the dog. So he thinks every dog I see can play that way. Then when it hits that juvenile stage, then all of a sudden, if the other dog doesn't like it, that's when quickly the problem starts. Look at that, that's lovely. <laughs> He's just got to obviously learn his size. Yeah. Like, look, he's playing really nicely. Look, oh, bless him. <laughs> <laughs> Not actually seen this side of Ace. Normally, no. Ace is like the most calm, laid back dude in the world. Yeah, he doesn't do a lot of running, bless him. <laughs> but yeah, like I said, the reason Ace has got no reactivity issues whatsoever towards other dogs, the fact that he's a year old nearly and he's still got his testicles and people say, oh, you've got to neuter Rottweilers, otherwise they'll become aggressive. Again, absolute bullshit. It's because ever si you got me in ever since he was a pup, so yeah. he's done structured socialising, pack walks, where he's been able to meet some of the dogs and interact with some of the dogs, but also learn that not every dog there he can say hello to, and that there's other ways of playing with a dog other than just yeah. jumping on him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Same as in the classes, teaching him obedience around other dogs, yeah? And it's also socialising because he's around other dogs, he's just not necessarily playing with them yeah, like no, people think right, yeah. people think socializing the dogs have to be doing this this is just this is the bonus of socializing because you can have a dog that can do this yeah but a dog that doesn't need to do this with every dog it sees i can't see now you've gone behind the uh, swimming pool yeah when we was in tenerife right come back look at the wind apparently you had you apparently you guys have really bad weather down here